What's up ladies and gents, my name's Craig, otherwise known as Undisclosed Host. Uh, what you see in front of you is a prison. Uh, I've been wanting to do this for quite some time. I was kind of waiting for Creative to come along because doing big projects like this on your own uh, is a bit of a fucking nightmare. So, you know, here it is. Um, it is just a shell at the moment, or kind of the shell in most parts. I've yet to do the, the, the you know, nitty gritty design, you know, add, add in chairs and tables and all that shit. Uh, and yesterday I, I, I did a dungeon in as well. Uh, I kind of got the sizes wrong for this. I thought it was going to be bigger than what it was. I thought it was going to be much bigger. But as I say, I'm not one for doing big projects, so I thought 50 across and about 70 in length was was more than enough, but um, it seems it wasn't. So uh, this, this is what we have up top. So we've got um, a couple of shady looking <laughs> cell blocks there. Uh, those were really fucking hard to do. I don't know why they shouldn't have been, but those were really hard to get sort of cell blocks all the same size, sort of reasonable size and height. Uh, and that's that's what I come up with either side there. Um, also a couple of sort of basic towers, sort of watch towers there. There was supposed to be four in each corner, but because of the because I fucked up on my my sizing, I couldn't be arse extending it. I've got to you know I've only got two at the front, and this is the um this is the dungeon. Uh, Knocked up over the weekend. Um, I'm going to have to get some torture devices down here, which I shall be calling on Nez Joe for assistance because uh, I'm fucking terrible with redstone. Absolutely terrible. Well, I'm not bad. I mean, I can follow a tutorial, don't get me wrong, but uh, he can just knock it up, like, off the top of his head and sort of mash something together. Um, you should actually have a look at. He's got a redstone vending machine up at the moment. Uh, quite a unique one at that. Um, the one he's built uh, serves up multiple blocks, so you can select, <coughs> you know, let's say iron, cobblestone, and uh, some diamond. Let's say you flip the switch, and it will keep dispensing until you press stop. Now, most of the, of the dispensers out there, or the redstone vending machine dispensers, um, work on single blocks. So when you press the button, it gives you a single block of each kind that you pre-select, which is why this one's quite unique. So give it a look, you know, rate, comment, uh, and all that jazz. Um, we'll try to get it up to 100 views at the moment. It's it's kind of lingering at 94, 95. It's like you know the first one of our videos is going to hit 100, so uh, we're quite chuffed with that. Actually, no, I tell a lie. I tell a lie, it isn't. That's rubbish. It's the redstone creeper that's actually going to hit 100 soon. That's at 95 at the moment. Yeah, redstone creeper uh, shrine type deal, which is also up there if you want to give that a look. Uh, yeah, sorry, kind of gone off. Up here, um, we're kind of just in this random house I built. Uh, this this was like the first house uh, I did before I decided I was going to the prison, and it, I think I'm going to just turn it into like sort of staff quarters type type um, enjoyment pleasure area. Uh, I don't know, it's kind of it's kind of random. It's, it's it's like not got bedrooms in, but it's got a bar and a fucking fountain. So I don't know. Anyway, I've I've chatted enough random bullshit on this one. Uh, thanks again for watching. Always much appreciated for those for those of you who do come across these videos and do decide to watch it for more than a, a minute or so. Let me know what you think of prison or anything that should be added or taken away. Uh, again, thanks, and I'll catch you later.